What does a sales cycle look like in your business? Depending on the industry, the services you deliver, it can look very different. In the systems improvement space, it can vary from a few weeks up to several months. I closed a deal the other day that I've been working on for eight months now. Eight months ago, I started talking with this prospect. We were really excited to get started. They were very excited to get started. They reached out to me via YouTube and they had seen the videos. They knew what was next. They knew what the process would look like, but for whatever reason, it took eight months. Now, of course, things always come up. There's out of office, there are shifting priorities within companies, there are people that change roles, and so we experienced all of those things with this one prospect, now client. Now, what I wanna stress here is the importance of having a proper systemized sales system. Are you using a CRM? That's number one. And do the stages in your CRM align with the culture of your company? Are you providing educational information? Or are you simply writing emails along the lines of, hey, just following up? The prospect does not wanna hear that you're following up. What the prospect really needs is to understand that you know what their problem is and you have an answer for that. But what does that look like when you are sending emails once a week or a couple times a week over the span of eight months? Put yourself in those shoes. What would you do? How would you respond personally if someone was simply sending an email to you once a week asking to follow up? Are they trying to solve your problem? Are they proving their worth or their value? Are they trying to be helpful? What does that look like and what do you want to see? Are you sending helpful blogs that you've written with the email, hey, I wrote this blog, thinking of you, thought this might help you and your team. Hey, I just recorded this new video, this might help the problem that we're trying to solve with your team. In any of those email examples, never do the words, hey, how are things going? Or just following up, or hey, did you read the proposal? Or, or hey, did you get approval from your boss? It's, hey, I'm here, I'm a resource, I can solve your problems, and I've now shown you umpteen different ways that we can do that. A lot of people would have given up in week three, four, five, six, whatever that may be. But with steady dedication to the process, nurturing that lead, showing that you understand their problem, and showing them that you have a solution to that problem is the best thing that you can do to reinstill that trust and show them that you are the right choice to go with when it comes to how they can solve their problem. So stop following up and start helping.